which I just got out of Asda. Um, I think it's something like 20 past four or something. It's pitch black outside and ooh, fantastic lighting. Um, somehow I managed to spend a hundred pounds. Um, this is why I shouldn't come shopping. I've already spent 40 Aldi and now I've spent a hundred. But I did get another set of lights for my tree and the ones at home are going back. I don't think I'm going to keep that heart shaped tree topper that I got yesterday either. Um, I've bought two DVDs, one's a Christmas present and one's for me because it's a Christmas film I don't think I've ever seen. Um, but I still don't know how I spent £100. And then there was only one self checkout open with the conveyor belt thing. So I ended up behind the most awkward people ever who stood in the way so I couldn't get my shopping on and then took forever to do their shopping and they weren't even packing it as they were putting it through and then the self checkout was just constantly playing up saying that I'd not put things through and I had and saying oh well trying to get me to pay twice with the same items basically um, so I'm just going to go and get some diesel in my car and then drive home and I'm starving so I can't wait to get home um, it's just bang on five and I've just walked in I did get stuck in a little bit of traffic because obviously it's coming up for five so the traffic starts um, but I'm home and somehow I've got to show you the shopping even though my kitchen is ram packed and here is the shopping I got one of my favourites oh, I've just totally forgot the name and I'm there going it's one of my favourites it's a poinsettia I just remembered um, it was only three pounds and Normally, as the ones are all dying, but these were actually in water surprise price, and it's a really nice pot. They normally put them in a plastic one, so I'm very happy with that. One bounce bar, tin of hot dogs for the dog, bowl, two in one, sparkling bloom, and a yellow poppy. Winter spice ribena, I do have one over there, you can just about see, but it's got um, a used by date. From the beginning of this year so I just thought I'll get this because it is lovely then there is a Dr Pepper a almond milk out the chilled section a pack of 10 pens because most of my pens have run out because I literally write too much a tin of dog food a caramel macchiato misfits then sticks I got the wrong ones I normally get the mint ones but she's gonna have to do with them then I got this broccoli rice then I realised it's broccoli chopped up into little tiny pieces and I could have bought a piece of broccoli and done it myself. Then we've got Nurofen capsules and I've accidentally picked up the small pack but it'll do. Then I got this new hamster bedding. It never has this one normally but it's all they had and it looks interesting. Then the two DVDs, I got this for my dad, it was one of his Christmas presents, we went and saw this tour, it isn't actually this one because this was filmed somewhere else, oh it was filmed during his UK tour, but it weren't the night we went. Then the second film I got was Deck the Halls, Danny DeVito is one of my favourite actors, I've never actually seen this that I can remember, and it was only £3 so I just thought, why not? Then another caramel, caramel macchiato, then a cafe latte, just because I like the Christmas packaging and I've got some vanilla um, syrup so I'll just whack some of that in. Then I got a bigger, a bigger box of these, um, I'm going to take the other ones back because this is twice the size so this should fit my tree. Then I got some crackers for my dad. I didn't know which ones he wanted, but I know he likes them. Some hobnobs, which I got just to dunk in cups of teas, but I'll probably end up eating like that much of the packet and my dad will end up with the rest because he's he's got such a sweet tooth. Three more Dr Peppers. Then my favourite moisturiser. I got two different ones last week to try. I got the BB version of this and then the... um extra light version of this I can't remember what it's called and then I thought if it's still on offer I'll get this one which is the one I generally use and it's only seven pounds so I got that I mean if it's still on offer next week I will pick up another one then I got these for my hamster he normally gets some from pets at home which are better than this um, and got better ingredients in but I thought 
I'll just get these, even though I will be going to pets at home probably this weekend. Caramel Macchiato. Then there's three of the Strawberry Elderflower and Juniper Presse, Presse, whatever you want to call it. Mature Cheddar. Then I've got four of these. I actually wanted to get a couple of these because um, I haven't had them for ages and I was thinking about them. And then when I went, I saw they were a pound each, which is quite expensive to be honest. Um, but it was four for three pounds, so obviously I got four. Then I got mouthwash for my dad. Um, I don't think he's been using it recently, and he used to use it all the time, so I just picked one up. Cadbury's buttons, as always. I got a pack yesterday, so I only picked up one pack. Some Mentos chewing gum, which I always use if I go and walk the dog. This is what I chew on. It helps with my anxiety if I feel a bit anxious because I'm chewing on something. It's kind of taking my mind off things a little bit, so that's what I've been for. Take the tea bags. I don't like PG tips, and my tea bags are about to run out. I actually do have a box of PG tips there, but I don't like them, so that's why they're there. I'm hoping my dad will drink them. Then there's a loaf of bread. Then I got these Christmas cards. I don't generally send a lot of Christmas cards out now, and um, not many people do. But I just thought I'll get these because they're absolutely gorgeous and they've got this rose gold colour on. I know it's coming up on, as gold on the camera, but well, there's some gold and then there's some rose gold. So I got them and the charity ones as well, which makes it even better. Then I got this bunch of flowers because most of them are dead. I don't know if they're going to split into two parts, but we'll see what I can do. Then down on the floor, two Diet Cokes, two Pepsi Maxis and an orange Lucas aid and then there is 16 toilet rolls then i bought this it says prosecco made me do it um i don't really drink prosecco but i'm going to drink it over christmas i think but i just liked it and it's sequins and it was only nine pounds it's just a basic long black t-shirt well long, long sleeve i don't think they're full length i think they're probably three quarter length and i like the fact that it is got a gift tag on it so if you wanted to give it as a present you can do but i just thought it'd be nice to just wear with jeans and stuff over christmas so now i'm going to try and put this shopping away um yeah i'm not looking forward to this challenge because i whacked everything in the fridge before i went out because i was in a hurry because obviously i want to get back before five because i don't want to get caught in that traffic but I'm absolutely knackered today I don't know why I'm this tired but I am um I almost passed out twice in Asda I just got really like head and I was like I need to stop stand still um for a few seconds and I was like and then walk slowly but I don't know what's wrong with me well I kind of do but I'm not going to discuss it on here um I don't feel great today. Um, I've still got a temperature and I don't know, I just, I'm not feeling too well. Um, I've somehow got to go and put all that shopping away. I don't know where I'm going to put it. Um, I need to move that DVD before my dad comes home. I mean, he's not due home anytime soon, but I need to move that. Um, then I think I'm going to have my tea, but I don't know what I'm going to have because I've got too much choice now. I've just walked in the kitchen and this is what I'm faced with. Shoot me now, please, because I don't know where all this is going to go. Because if you look inside my fridge, that looks like that. Oh, something's gone off in here. Now I've got to find that. But look at that. And then look at that. I am so hungry I literally opened this and I don't like olives but I was so desperate for food I could only get this corner open at the beginning so I had an olive um these are all right they're not what I thought they would be and I love them so they're just gonna go and that's a mild cheese so I will be eating that I've got a curry in the oven and I'm gonna have it with that broccoli rice but the sides looking better I've just had to move all the stuff but I'm going to have to give the house a good tidy tomorrow because there's just stuff everywhere. I can't live like this. There you go. Chicken tikka masala with broccoli rice. 
a couple of broccoli rice in the frying pan with some coconut oil and obviously some garlic granules because I put that on everything. It does say cook that um, broccoli in the microwave but I weren't going to do that. My house is doing my head in. I, there is stuff just everywhere. I don't know where to put it. I really don't. Like I had in my office, like I don't know if you've seen behind me, there's like a unit and it's got like black things in that you can put things in I was using one of them to store Christmas presents in and it's full um, so now I've got Christmas presents all over the house because I'm getting more and more obviously because we're getting nearer and they're like I've just dumped a load on here but I need that space so I don't know what I'm gonna do and then there's a ton of stuff in my kitchen as well um, not really Christmas presents now, but um, oh, just just stuff everywhere. Like I can't even find anywhere to put anything down. And I literally have zero motivation to do anything. But there's just stuff everywhere. Like I've got this poinsettia. I think it's going to go in the window because I think I'm going to bin all the flowers, wash the vases, put one bunch of flowers in a vase, and then just have my poinsettia in the window but then I think it might be too cold in the window I don't know and there's just pens and there's baubles and there's Christmas lights and there's outdoor Christmas lights and there's Christmas cards and there's a box for my new phone it's just like oh god I'm so like I was just running out of places to put things I'm gonna have to do something about this now I really oh, I'm gonna have to have a mini tidy up I've also managed to tidy the kitchen a little bit um it was frustrating the life out of me so i've gone in and done a bit um obviously i've got stuff to take upstairs but it's looking a lot better than it did although it still could do with some more work on it it is actually it's a lot better um obviously the christmas baubles are going to go on the tree um this i don't know i'm not i don't know like i liked it in the shop but now i've got it i don't um these are the other lights, these might end up on the tree as well. Um, that's a lot of money for lights so though, 16 and 8 is £24, I could have just bought a massive box. Like the ones I've got over here for outside were literally £15 and I literally tried to get some today in Aldi and they didn't have any Christmas lights at all and I tell you what, there would have been enough there. So, kind of kicking myself now, but it's done. So, yes, my sides are looking a lot better. I mean, it's still not perfect, but it's better than what it was. Um, obviously, the baubles will be moved very soon when they're on the tree. And the other set of lights. I don't know if I want this on the tree, but all this won't be here very soon. And I need to try and decide where I want to put my cute little penguin. Um, I don't know, like I was going to put him in the kitchen window but now I've got my poinsettia there. I don't know, he needs to go somewhere because he's too adorable not to. And I've sorted the flowers out as well. I've put all those purple ones in there and there were some pink ones left that actually were still alive. So they're all together. The poinsettia is there, buried underneath the plant in that gorgeous gold um, pot. And this is just going to be put away because obviously I can't have two lots of flowers with a poinsettia. Hey guys, it's 4am and I've just come up to bed. Um, I've not felt chatty at all tonight. I felt quite down so I've not been filming myself. But I've been uploading clips to this channel from Tuesday. I've, I've just uploaded the 25th and I've been uploading for hours and hours and hours. This is why I get so frustrated with this whole vlogging thing because when I do film a lot i spent hours and hours uploading then i can't use my phone at the same time which is frustrating for me um so i've been doing that i've been doing bits and pieces of tidying around the house because i got frustrated with the kitchen so i tidied that up a little bit then i was tidying up my living room a little bit of my bedroom and my office um i just felt like i don't know like i wanted things to be cleaner and tidier I've cleaned my bathroom, um, I've cleaned my sink, my toilet, my shower, I just went on a bit of a cleaning mission. Um, I've eaten a lot as well, like I was really hungry, 
So I've had a beef sandwich, I've had um, one of those yogurts with honey. Um, I had these pea crisps things before, um, I finished them off. I've had two chocolate half knots, I've had a cup of tea, I've had another Dr Pepper. Um, yeah, I was hungry, so I've ate a lot. I've just been doing some emails to the police who seem to be ignoring me even though I'm asking them for help. I just like, what do I need to do? Like, does the person have to murder me before you take any notice? So I've done emails to them, done a couple of bits around the house. I've done all my returns, there was a lot to sort out. And um, watch TV, but I didn't really concentrate. Um, NCIS was on, um, I don't remember much of it. Cat pay will take it away. Don't remember much of that. Um, there's probably been other things on. I've watched a bit of YouTube and that's about it. And I've just come upstairs. I'm sweating because it seems to have gone warmer rather than colder and the heating's on. So I'm going to take my makeup off now. Then I'm going to get in the shower and try and get to sleep for half past four or five probably more likely. Um, I'm going to get up at 11, I've got stuff to do tomorrow, I need to go to the office to work, I need to come home, I need to sort post out, I need to finish a couple of blog posts, I need to edit for this channel, I need to get, I've already edited it but I need to put um, titles and the end bit on each video for the next three and schedule them and write the description boxes so that will be Friday, Saturday, Sundays. Um, I need to edit a video from my other channel before I go out tomorrow but I'm hoping to go out at 1 so I need to get it done quickly probably going to end up going out at half 1, 2 o'clock you know what I'm like now but yeah I've not felt chatty and I've got a ton of clips to upload like I've uploaded 25 from Tuesday I've probably got another 25 then I've got all today's and I've filmed a lot so it is frustrating that it's like all night like constantly upload, upload, upload it takes an average of 10 minutes per clip, some take longer, it's just so frustrating. Anyway, I'm sweating, I need to go and get in the shower, then I'm going to dive into bed. So the next time you'll see me will be tomorrow, hopefully. Night, guys.